Hello everyone and welcome to the One Class channel. My name is Donna and I'm a recent master's graduate from the Material Science program from the University of Ontario Institute of Technology, also known as Ontario Tech University. So today we're going to go over some commonly asked questions in chemistry at the high school, college, and university level. So if you needed any help with homework or with tutoring, then check out the links in the description below. Now let's just get started on our set of questions for today's session. Okay, so question one asks, what is the percentage of iron in an iron ore, which is 60% by mass of iron three oxide? Okay, so let's write down what we know. We know that 60% uh, of iron is in iron three oxide. So let's write down the formula or iron 3 oxide just so that we can see how many iron atoms are in iron 3 oxide so we know that the iron has an oxidation state of 3 and we know that since this is not a peroxide, then our oxygen has an oxidation state of minus 2. So that makes our chemical formula Fe2O3. Okay, so now that we know the chemical formula of iron 3 oxide, let's find out its molar mass. So the molar mass of iron 3 oxide will just be 2 times the molar mass of iron plus 3 times the molar mass of oxygen. So these are values you can just find on your periodic table. And the molar mass of iron is 55.8 grams per mole. And the molar mass of oxygen is around 16 grams per mole. So now if we sum these values up, we end up getting a molar mass of 159.6 grams per mole. Okay, so now that we know the molar mass of iron 3 oxide, let's assume we have one mole of sample. Just so that we can compare everything in grams. So we know that 60% of the iron 3 oxide uh, contains iron. So if we solve, if we let x equal the mass of iron, then we can try to find out uh, the mass in this sample. So we know 60% of it is the iron, so we just need to say 0.6x is equal to 159.6 grams. So this is the total molar mass of iron 3 oxide. And now we just need to solve for x. So if we divide both sides by 0 0.6, we get x is equal to 266 grams. Okay, so this is step one. 
And now step two, we know that in iron three oxide, there are two iron atoms. So if we think about the molar mass of just iron, it is 55.8 grams per mole. So if we multiply this value by 2, we can get the mass of iron. So, 55.8 times 2 gives us 111, or yeah, 111.6 grams. So we know the mass of iron ore, which is 206 grams. And now we also know the mass of iron. So now, step three is to find the percentage of iron in iron ore. So we take the mass of our iron, which is 111.6 grams. And we divide that by the mass of iron ore, which is 266 grams. And if you multiply this by 100, we can get the percentage, which is 41.95%. Okay, so now let's see what the junior tutor said. This problem states that an iron ore is 60% by mass of iron 3 oxide, which has a chemical formula of Fe2O3. To solve this problem, we set the following variables. X is the mass of iron ore, and Y is the molar mass of iron 3 oxide. So they set y equals to x, uh, y equals to 60% x. Uh, so it's basically the same as our first step. And then they calculated the molar mass of iron 3 oxide. So they also got 159.68. And then they get, got the mass of iron ore by multiplying or dividing your molar mass of iron 3 oxide by 0 0.6. So they also got 266 grams of iron ore. Okay, so then they found the mass of iron by multiplying the molar mass of iron by 2, and then they divided the values to also get around 41.9% of iron. So this solution is correct.